diploma hanging on my neck. The brace match is a set. My brother named his team the dollars. I bought it back and forth over the net. My mama wish I would have went corporate. She wish I would have went exec. I still turn to a CEO, so the lifestyle she respect. Hey, two sprints to Quebec. Shall we put him on back? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Genesis Samar, and if you're not new here, hey! If you're watching this video right now, go ahead and like the video. If you don't want to subscribe, then just like the video. It helps me out, so like the video. Go like it down there. Yeah. As I saw from the title, today is a back-to-school emergency kit video, so it's really more targeted towards females. I don't really have a large percentage of males watching my videos, probably like 1%. So if you are a male, I mean, you can watch this, I guess. But like, more towards females, so... If you want to watch this to support me, I appreciate you. Thank you. But I was just giving y'all a heads up. So yeah, this is the little emergency kit. Super bright, you can't see. It's focused on my face. Okay, there it goes. Pink. It says, hello, beautiful. But yeah, I put everything in it because I want to see if everything will fit in there and it does so I guess I'll just pull it all out Yeah, I got this at Marshall's for seven dollars Although I'm not going back to school I've decided to do this video and all the stuff that I got I'm giving to my sister So it's not going to waste and most of the stuff I'm gonna use on myself, but this I'll probably give to my sister So let's get into the actual video. Okay, first things first I feel like if you have a phone you need a charger you go to school you say you didn't charge your phone Like cuz I know there's them nights where you be forgetting to charge your phone like you be so tired You just go to sleep. I be having them nights all the time so, I feel like a charger is essential to have. You need to have you a school charger and then have a home charger. I recommend like a regular charger because you know them fast chargers, if you lose that, it's over. So, get you like a regular charger that you're like cool with somebody end up taking it. Like you won't be as upset if somebody took like your fast charger. You know what I'm saying? Have you a little charger so you can charge your phone while you're at school if it's dead. Or like your AirPods or whatever. Since we're in electronics, get you some headphones, AirPods. I don't know if this is an emergency kit, but like you need it on the daily. It's an emergency. Like when you're bored or just in general, walking in the hallways and stuff. You do some AirPods, you do some headphones. It don't gotta be AirPods, it can be the cord ones, cord ones work, whatever. It don't even gotta be Apple product. Like, just get like some headphones that you can listen to music and walk through the hallways, you know? Okay, I don't know if I can say it on YouTube. But y'all know what this is for. I haven't worn one of these in a minute. But I found it and I was like, this would be like a good thing to put in an emergency kit because some people need it. I'm not going to go into detail what it is. Y'all know what y'all know. I just don't want YouTube to take, up, take down my video or like strike me or whatever happens when you say it a certain word. Y'all know what I'm going to say. I think I can put it on the screen. I don't know, but I'm going to put the, it start with a C. The C word, yeah. That word and then the new M word. I don't know if I can say that either, but... Y'all know, like, if y'all in the internet, y'all know what I'm talking about. Like, people probably wearing their masks now back to school because of those two things. So, need it, put in your emergency kit, there you go. Although, if you're wearing one of them, your mouth, your lips cannot be dry. You can't walk around with no dry lips. You need some Vaseline. Get you a little Vaseline like this. Get you a little lip gloss. I don't really use, I don't use this one, but I found it because I couldn't find my other one. So, use a lip gloss and Vaseline trick. Put Vaseline on before you put lip gloss on because lip gloss can still dry your lips out. I feel like it always leaves my lips like white or whatever. So put Vaseline in lip gloss. And if you don't got lip gloss, just put Vaseline. Anybody can use Vaseline. Lip gloss is extra if you want to like. My lip gloss is cool. My lip gloss. Yeah. We also got some lotion. I like this little, little carry-on lotion. Like the um, travel size lotion, it's Jergens. You know them days, especially when it gets cold, y'all need this. Like, y'all be ashy. I don't know how y'all be leaving the house without, not y'all, but like how people be leaving the house with no lotion on and be like thinking that's cool. Like, you gotta put some lotion on before you leave the house. And then you use this. If you put lotion on, then you get ashy again. Like, this is like, pick a little lotion up. Like, this is a no full body Use this for your full body to lotion up. This really come in handy when it's cold in the winter time because when you hit that cold air, them ankles be getting ashy. If you know, you know. Them ankles be ashy. So go ahead and get you some lotion and put in your emergency kit because you don't want no ashy ankles. You don't want no you don't want no ashy elbows either. So put in your emergency kit so you don't gotta go through that. All right, next we got some deodorant. Deodorant. D e o d o r a n t. Make sure you get you a little small deodorant because like if you got gym or something or you just feel a little like funky throughout the day, well, okay. 
when I say funky, that don't mean you really stink. You didn't take no shower today. Put on deodorant. That's not going to save you. But if you like sweating a little and you like, okay, my armpits getting a little sweaty. Put some, roll some deodorant on throughout the day and you be straight. But if you ain't take no shower and you just straight up musty, just go ahead and go home and get in the shower. Because that's something like I'm talking to boys. Females, I don't really think you shouldn't really be musty as a female. Unless it's like some like, whatever. Um, But yeah, if you feel a little... A little hot, a little sweaty, go ahead and put you some deodorant on. It'll save you. I guarantee. Let's do the little cute stuff. We can save the y'all know the period stuff is gonna come. So ain't no sense of me adding that in the front because y'all know that's gonna come. You know that you need that. So right now, since I didn't even tell y'all this one a mask, but get you some hand sanitizer, a little hand sanitizer. I think they got these at Dollar Tree for like one dollar. You can go ahead and get you one. Just even without all this coat, um, sorry. Even without all this, like, you know. Um, this crisis that we're in, this, um, can I say the pan we're in, whatever it's called. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. I don't, I'm too scared to say it because I don't want to mess anything up with the YouTube guidelines or whatever. Get you some hand sanitizer, use it because people be dirty at school. After you touch certain stuff that other people have touched, just stay clean, you know? Now y'all know, when it comes to school, we in that school building for forever. And when I went to school, I did not have lunch till like 12 o'clock and we got there at like 7 and then we got out of school at like two. So, but if you hungry in the morning, need something to eat, get you a little snack. I got a granola bar. I probably wouldn't really bring this to school. Well, actually I would because I'd be hungry. It don't really matter. But like bring you a little snack. And then if you don't have no snacks that you can bring from home, get you like a little thing of gum. They got these at like one, they got these for $1. Like it comes with a pack of four of these things for one dollar at Dollar Tree. So get you, if you don't got a dollar, get you, find you some little coins on the ground, get you your dollar and get you some gum. Now I know the dollars be adding up, but you feel me like it's cheaper than, I don't know what I'm trying to say for real, but go ahead and get you some gum and a little snack, okay? Now for the um, beauty girls, y'all know when y'all at school, you be coming late sometimes or you didn't do your hair. Get you an edge brush and some gel. Me personally, I love when my edge brush is dirty. Not like that. But like when it got that that little bit of dry edge control and make it harder, your edges be laid in so much better. And then you got some edge control. Get you like a little small edge control or like this a little small one and take it on the go with you and leave it in your bag and get you a separate edge brush so you don't have to like bring the one you use at home to school and bring it back and forth. You can just keep it in an emergency kit and you'll always have it. So yeah, get your little edge brush, your gel, whatever you use, edge control, whatever. Use that. Put in your bag and you'll never have to worry about your edges not being laid at school. Also, since we own hair, get you a little pack of hair ties. So like, let's say for instance, I don't know, me personally, when I'm working, I don't like my hair like in my face. Or if I'm in gym, when I was in gym or APC, APC is a weight class. When I was in them classes, I never liked my hair down, so I'll always have like a ponytail holder. I would never have a ponytail holder. I would have to wait, look at my track bag for one because I always kept one in there. But I just feel like it's necessary for you to have some type of hair tie, hair band, hair headband, whatever. Rubber band, bobby pins, like all that little hair stuff that's essential to have at school, especially if you're a female. Like you gotta be able to deal with your hair. So get you some hair ties. I got this at Dollar Tree for $1 as well. Like all this stuff you can really find at Dollar Tree. You don't have to spend a whole bunch of money. Like you could probably spend like $10 on your emergency kit. Counting the bag, probably 15. So I think it's worth it. And then we got some mascara, Jaden, AKA my sister. If you're watching this, yes, I stole your mascara for this video because I just threw mine out. I gotta re-up on my mascara, but for now this is the one. This one's actually really good. Yeah, get you some mascara that you can bring to school because I don't really wear makeup. This is probably the most makeup I'll ever wear. I only wear make mascara and lip gloss. So get you some lip gloss and get you some mascara. Or if you bring makeup, get you a little, bring you a little makeup palette or whatever and put it in here so you can have something to like touch up your makeup. Maybe bring like concealer or foundation and just put it in the bag and you'll be straight. Like if you need to touch up your makeup when you get to school or whatever. And then I also got this travel size. Valentino perfume. I have used a little bit of it, but I think it's good to have like a travel size perfume because when you out, you want to smell good. Like I can't leave the house without perfume now. Like I can if I'm running a quick errand, 
But if I know I'm gonna be out for like more than 30 minutes, I'm probably gonna put perfume on because I like knowing that I smell good. Like, I love the scent of perfume. So I just been really into perfumes and I feel like y'all should be into perfumes too because as a female, you should wanna smell good. So get you a little body mist, perfume, whatever you use, use it and get you a little travel size to put in your emergency kit. So you can always smell good. And if you wear lashes, get you some lash glue and put it in your bag. I do got this little lash, I don't know if I can see. I got this little lash glue. Um, I used to want to try and wear lashes, but it just doesn't look right on me. So I've gotten like individuals, but like extra strips, I can't do that. So um, I just got some lash glue sitting around. I was like, that's the perfect thing to put in your emergency kit. If you do wear lashes, you can fix your lashes up while you're at school. Like if they're coming off, get your lash glue at your emergency kit. Boop, put your lash back on. Batty back in action, that quick. So. Here's the last thing everybody knows what to do with this. This is the thing every female should know to bring to school. If you don't got an emergency kit, you need, you need to at least have this stuff in your backpack. I don't care. Now, I don't wear tampons, but I do wear pads. So, get you some pads. Get you some pads or some liners, whatever you use, or tampons. Whatever you use, keep it in your bag. Keep a couple because you never know what you feel like using or what you want to wear or what you need to wear. Or even if your friend needs something, you can always have some in stock. So make sure you're always restocking it too because you never know what could happen. You know, females, one thing about females, I like about females, when it comes to periods and cycles, we're always there to help each other. Like we always, that's one thing I know. One thing I do like about being a female, like when it comes to that, we can always come together and help each other out like you don't have a pad you can literally ask somebody do you have a pad with you boom they got a pad you're set like you know but i wouldn't do it with nobody i don't trust but like you know yeah and then have you some wipes because especially when it, you start out of nowhere you wanna, you're gonna wanna clean up because you're gonna feel like, I don't know, I, when I start mine, I be feeling dirty, so I always keep some wipes. I always have wipes, especially when I'm on my cycle because I just, that's the dirtiest I ever feel. I shower the most during that time because I just don't feel the best. Like, I just feel dirty. So keep you some wipes so you can be able to clean up after yourself and all that. Also get you a pair of underwear, extra pair of underwear, keep it in there. Just in case you never know, you can always bleed through. So get you like a little period underwear and keep that in your emergency kit so you can have that if anything was to ever happen and all that stuff fits in here so i just feel like that's a perfect emergency kit like it's literally full so go ahead and pack yours right now if you're watching this is your sign to go ahead and make yours because i know you need it or if you needed some ideas hopefully i gave y'all some ideas to put in your emergency kit this year yeah so that's pretty much the video i hope you guys enjoyed today's video let me know in the comments down below when you're starting school when you're going back to school if you're not going back to school then you can let me know what your plans are or what you want to do make sure you subscribe if you made it this far because why not join the family we're on the road to 10k so you don't want to be on that side of the club. You can't be hating from outside the club if you ain't want to get in. <laughs> Anyways, um, I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. See you guys in my next video. Bye!